Hello everybody, it's Sandy McGee. It is day 35 of my showdown challenge and today I just wanted to share with you a little bit about my feelings on being your own person, running your own race. Uh, we're not in this to win a race fast. We don't have to necessarily be on the fast track. Now there are people that will do this fast and there are people who want to succeed at any cost and will knock people over to get that, to that place where they want to be. That's fine. That's what they want to do. That's fine. But my point is don't expect everybody to be like you. There's no requirement that you have to be like anybody else. There's no requirement that says that we have to be on a fast track. To me, you make your own track just like you make your own future. You make your own day. You make your own day. You set your priorities and you keep those priorities and you don't let anything stand in the way of those pri priorities. You know what it is that you want to accomplish today. So you accomplish it at your own pace. And if by chance you fail, get back up, dust yourself off, and start over again. Because there are plenty of people that are out there that can tell you every reason why you will not succeed. There are plenty of people out there that will not support what you're doing. But you have to always remember that you're not doing this for anybody other than yourself. It's your, you yourself. You and your health. You and your success. That's the only thing you measure against is yourself. And so with that, I, I just want to say to there, there are so many voices that will tell you what to do and why you can't do it and how it can't be done because it's been tried before. Will set back. They will wait for you to fail. You have to learn to develop yourself to hear that small quiet voice, that voice that in spite of all the other voices that you're hearing telling you that you cannot do this or you cannot do that, you have to listen to that quiet, still voice and when you develop to the ear to hear that, you will hear it telling you, yes, you can. And it's an atmosphere like what I'm sitting in. It's on my patio, it's quiet. You can hear some chimes. Just go someplace and be still so that you can hear that voice telling you how awesome you are. And I hope my voice is encouraging you to realize how awesome you are. There's only one you. Don't be a copy. Be yourself. Walk this race, run this race, jog this race, however you want to do this. Do it where you're proud of yourself. Do it not for someone else to pat you on your back, but for you to reach over and pat yourself and give yourself a big hug and tell yourself how great you are. And so with that, I'm just going to leave you with a quote from um, William James. And William James says that the art of being wise is the art of knowing what to overlook. So let's overlook our own faults and other people's faults. Let's overlook the fast track, the fast race, the hurry up mentality, get there like yesterday. Let's overlook some hurts in our life. Let's overlook um, people that have not supported you and you will be wise. So with that, I hope you have enjoyed my video and rated a 10 underneath. And remember that together we climb or we climb not at all. So give it a 10. Bye life, baby. It's a good life. Make it a great day. Make it your day. Bye-bye.